Mia, we've got to go. Today is Tuesday and I had not a great sleep last night. I don't feel tired. I fell asleep late and then I was up during the night with insomnia and nightmares and just, I don't know, like, I'm kind of, I can feel my brain a bit on, teetering on the edge. Hold on, both start school tomorrow. But for some reason, their school had to make today a PA day. So, I've got a lot to do today. And at the same time, I want to acknowledge that they're going to school tomorrow. So I'm gonna try to find that sweet spot. Morning, Bo. Yeah. How are you feeling? You got a cold, right? Okay, the kids are all ready. We're about to go out the door. They're playing house. Where are you sitting? Oh, we gotta go to school. If you haven't already sensed it by now, Mia is giving us the hardest time lately. She likes to be in charge and call the shots, and if we say up, she says down. It's been a bit tricky lately. And it always shocks people like, Mia, really? Yes, Mia. I feel like I'm negotiating with you to get down. We gotta go put our shoes on. You have to get off. No, offy. What's offy? You need to get off and we gotta get our shoes on. We gotta go. No, it's the kitchen. No, you're not sitting on the kitchen. We've gotta go. Okay, I'm gonna have to put this down and pick her up and take her. And she'll probably be kicking and screaming. Uh, deep breaths, deep breaths. We're at Walmart now and I am trying to curb the spending. We got toothpaste, toothbrushes, notebook, wipes. No, those are for removing makeup. We'll decide to start trashing the pillow section. <laughs> Was that an accident? Yeah. <laughs> what are you doing? Oh no! <laughs> Holy, you better be careful. They're gonna kick you out of Walmart. We're testing out step stools because we think that me and Everly need stools for their bathroom. Ew, where did you get that spoon? Almost done running our errands. I have to go pick up my thyroid prescription and then I can go work. Okay, we're home. We're finally done our shopping and we got a good haul. Um, I don't think we went too overboard. We didn't buy any new clothes this year. We got some supplies, toiletries, hair stuff. Um, I think we're good. I think we're good. So I'm still in back to school mode before I can head into my work and I've got a couple deadlines today. I've got a, my vlog and, the, and then I've got um, a baby center article I have to finish writing that goes up tomorrow and possibly another deadline if it comes through today. So busy. But I am sending the school holdings official report for his auditory processing disorder. I am also emailing um, the speech path that did it. Um, Holden and Bo, I don't know if you've noticed, have lisps or speech impediments that basically they can't pronounce their, I believe it's their R's and their TH's. Holden might be a bit better than Bo now. Holden had that from when he was young and I have a feeling because Bo kind of learned how to talk from Holden, from mimicking him, that she just kind of picked it up. I still feel a little like, I think it's just, it's a weird day. Um, and I just think I need to plow through and not expect perfection. We're heading out to get me and Everly, put them down for their naps, have lunch and continue the day. I feel a lot less stressed. I feel like I got a lot of stuff done and I'm starting to kind of um, get my bearings today. And I think I just felt really upside down because today is a funny day. So I think school needs to start tomorrow. Look who came to visit. My parents' dog guide puppy who they're fostering for a year. What do you think? Are you in love? So remember I said that I might have another deadline today? Oh, my ears are popping. I don't know why my ears are popping. Well, it happened. It came through and it's a good thing, but it's a stressful thing. So there's actually a time limit on it that I need to get it out onto the blog. So I inhaled my lunch um, and I'm sitting down to do that. And I still have two other deadlines today after that. <clears throat> it's a crazy day. 
I'm trying to stay calm. I'm trying not to get overwhelmed, but it's a crazy day. So my mood is completely changed. I'm in a much better mood and I'm gonna tell you why. Your why. From being like just kind of cranky, and it's a light in here, to feeling just lighter and happier and like let go of the little stuff. I was sitting on the couch and I started to go through all of your comments recently because I kind of let them build up and then I go and read them and try to get back to all of you. And they're so nice and I let, I see all of you. I see the same people commenting each video and it means so much, so much. Even if I don't get back to you right away, we see it, I share it with the kids and um, oh, it just, that really turned my mood around. So thank you guys. I'm about to go into the belly of the beast, which is the twins room. You being good? No one's naked today? You need your glasses? Guess what? Guess what I got for you girls today? Huh? Markers and new a new frozen coloring book. Do you want to go do that? You want to do some coloring with Bo and Holden? Yeah? yeah? I'm so glad I got that stuff. I am going to go on a cleaning rampage. I'm really excited to clean and get us ready for going back to school. time in our house and me and Everly lately have been going started to go through an extremely picky eating phase which I know Holden and Bo went through as well so one thing I'm learning is they don't want more than one thing on their plate at a time she me it's freaking because I put a few, few peas on her tray Everly you like that? you gonna eat it show me how you eat a meatball Mike is home and he is going to take the kids upstairs so I can get some of my work done. My hair. Okay. My hair. That is so handsome. Well, that's way better than your emo here. Yeah, the other Everybody's now relaxing as we watch Frozen up here. It's 9.20 and we are just sitting down for dinner now. Today was a mad dash. The kids are super excited for school tomorrow. Holden couldn't fall asleep because he's so excited, so that's a good sign. But he's just, everyone's asleep now. We're gonna eat dinner. Um, I'm confessing now, cereal is a part of my dinner tonight because that's the kind of day I've had. Hold on, I just wanna show everybody my sweater. <laughs> See you tomorrow, bye guys. And I remember Holden was really rough at this age. <sighs> Bo too. Bo got into a lot of trouble at this age. I find it's like meltdowns and bossy. And I just wanted to wrap up the day with you and mm -hmm. be real. And I think it's sometimes good to get the dad's perspective. I mean, I don't think that people hear that a lot.